Oh no! This is the mini golf with consequences date. This is a twist on a classic date night activity. For this, you're each going to need a pack of gum. Be sure to pick one you like the flavor of. So here are the consequences. If on a given hole, you shoot under par, your spouse has to put in a piece of gum. If on a hole you shoot over par, you have to put in a piece of gum. So on any given hole, you could end up putting in two pieces of gum. And you just keep adding to it over the course of the date. We'll show you how this works. You ready? So on that hole, I got one stroke under par. Danielle got one stroke over par. So that's two pieces of gum. Sorry. <laughs> Last time I picked cinnamon. Long game. Probably should have mentioned if you get par, you don't have to put any gum in your mouth, nor does your spouse. For some added fun, every five holes or so, try putting with your non dominant hand. It might level the playing field a little bit. <laughs> Is there any leveling? No, 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 no. It's this wad of gum. My equilibrium is off. Got a hole in one. Wow. You may want to start your conversation early in the game. It's going to be increasingly harder to have a conversation as the game is off. Words. No more gum. No more gum. Hmm, looks like you might want some more gum. So we lost track of score somewhere near the beginning. We decided to keep the score based on how many pieces of gum we have left. You didn't do so great. Brian and beat me by a long shot. Only by four pieces. That's not too bad. To end this date, we're gonna go get rid of this gum. Our jaws are in need of a break. They need something nice and cool, so we're going to go get some ice cream. We hope you enjoy your mini golf with consequences, and we wish you happy dating.